Hi friends, welcome to Heart Home and Travel. Virgin Hyperloop made history today as the first people successfully traveled in a Hyperloop car. Dubai based DP World made a multi-million dollar investment for the research and development of the Hyperloop technology. Today's success was an important milestone in the journey. Sultan Ahmed bin Zulayam, chairman of Virgin Hyperloop and group chairman and CEO of DP World, watched this passenger testing first hand in Las Vegas. The certification of this Hyperloop is a key step towards commercial project including those in Saudi Arabia and United Arab Emirates. Josh Giegel, co-founder and chief technology officer and Sarah Lucian, director of passenger experience, were the first people in the world to ride on their new form of transportation. The test took place at Virgin Hyperloop's 500-meter deep loop test site in Las Vegas where the company has previously run over 400 unoccupied tests. The occupants made their Maidan voyage on the newly unveiled XP2 vehicle. This was designed by Jork Angels Group which was custom built with occupant safety and comfort in mind. While the production vehicle will be larger and seat up to 28 passengers. This two-seater XP2 vehicle was built to demonstrate that passengers can in fact safety travel in a Hyperloop vehicle. Yes. Yes. <laughs> that was so good. That was awesome. Oh, that was awesome. I'm doing great. Amazing. <laughs> Hyperloop systems are designed to move passengers and or cargo at airline speeds at a fraction of cost of air travel. The train is designed to run in a vacuum tube that is suspended by magnetic systems. The vehicle can glide slightly for miles at speeds up to 1223 km per hour with very low turbulence. The system is proposed to be entirely autonomous, quite direct to destination and on demand. In 2016, Hyperloop One launched its Hyperloop One Global Challenge to find the location for the develop and construct the world's first Hyperloop networks. Ten winning routes were selected. This included Hyperloop networks in United States, India, Canada, Mexico and United Kingdom. In India, the selected routes were Bangalore to Chennai and Mumbai to Chennai. The Hyperloop system is expected to be fully functional by 2021. During JITEX 2019, the actual model of the Hyperloop pod was on display. This is how it looked like. If you like the video, please like and share and subscribe to our channel for more videos. Thanks for watching.